Hello everyone. Uh, my name is Hugh Pelser and I'm the chair of the World Boccia Competition Committee. It's obviously a very exciting time for Boccia because we're only two weeks ahead of the start of the Paralympic Games. And all of you athletes, coaches and spectators must be wondering who's going to play against who. That's why this Friday we are going to do the draw. And before we'll do that, I will briefly explain you in this video how the draw works. It's relatively simple. Uh, when we have X pools, the first X highest ranked athletes are seated first in the pool. So if there are four pools, the first four athletes in the ranking are seated on top of the four pools. Then we divide the other athletes into seating pots. So if there are four pools, the athletes ranked five to eight go in seating pot two, and the next four athletes in seating pot three, et cetera, in, until we have all the athletes in a seating pot. And then each seating pot is drawn randomly over the pools. So the athletes ranked five to eight in seating pot two are drawn into the second line of the pools, etc., until we have all the pools filled. And then there's one important rule, uh, and that's that we cannot have more than 50% of the athletes in a pool from the same country. I'll show you an example so you can see how it works. We have here uh, a random list of athletes. These are not the exact list of athletes that uh, are going to be in Paris. Um, but you can see that we've put it the first four highest ranked in seeding pot one, the next four in seeding pot two, and then the next four in seeding pot three. And then when we do the draw, you will see that the highest ranked athletes go, highest ranked goes to the first line in seeding pot one, the second to the first line in seeding pot two, et cetera. And then all the athletes in seeding pot two are randomly drawn over the pools into the second line of each pool. And the athletes in seeding pot three to the third line, again, randomly, so not in the order of the ranking. And if there would be 16 athletes, then there would be a fourth seeding pot and they would be drawn into the fourth line of each pool. We'll do a quick check. In a pool of three, we can have only one athlete from uh, each country. So no two athletes from the same country in a pool. So we'll check if that's correct. And if we see two athletes from the same country in a pool, we will do a swap with the next or the previous pool so that all athletes are from different countries. That's it. This Friday at one o'clock British summer time, uh, we will do the draw for the four male individual classes, the four female individual classes, and the three teams and pairs classes. It's going to be very exciting. We're going to know who's going to play who. We will have a schedule for the Paralympic Games. So make sure that you are there and we'll see you then. Bye bye.